Slow Ukraine! Hello comrades and welcome to a quick tutorial video. This is how to adjust equipment on soldiers uh, editing the MDL file. So, say you want your soldier to wear a particular helmet, but it doesn't fit. It's sticking to the side, it's slid all the way back, or it's like sitting all the way down. Uh, so how, how do we fix that? Well, here's how. So, we memorize the name of the helmet. So for us it was US Mic or Mic 100, right? So I have that already saved, but if you want, you go to, uh, normally you'll go to your mods folder, you go to Entity, Inventory, Equipment, Head. We're gonna look for our helmet. So US MICH or Mic. Find the MDL file. You have to open it with a notepad, obviously. It won't open with anything else. So, uh, up here, it's usually gonna say orientation. Uh, you know, here I'll just uh, it'll say orientation. So what you do is you'll delete it. You'll type in matrix 34. Now it's crucial that you don't put any space and that you put a capital M because if you don't, then it's gonna crash. And normally, what you have is just these three lines here, these three lines of numbers. We're gonna add a fourth. This is the positioning for our helmet. We're gonna put zero, zero, okay, so we're gonna put zero, tab, zero, tab. We're going to close, we're going to save. We're going to launch our game. And we start at all zeros just so we know where our default positioning is. So we can get a better idea of how to reposition it. Ugh, sorry about the voice, I'm a bit sick. We're just gonna load. Inventory, equipment, head, scroll all the way down. And if it crashes for you, then it means you uh, type something wrong. So just delete the MDL file and replace it with the new one. Or with whatever. Make sure you have a copy of the original MDL file. In case you do run into any issues. Here. Look at that, it almost fits. Yet as you see, it's sticking back a bit into the uh, face. Um, so, we want it to be sitting down a little bit lower. I think it's just mainly we want it to sit down a bit lower. That's about the only issue, because as you can see, the earpiece is not covering the ear. I'm gonna exit. Back to the MDL file. Now uh, the, the uh, fourth line is your X, Y, and Z. So we're going to edit this. We're going to do minus one, just just to see, because sometimes you have to get very specific with the numbers to get it to fit. Ugh. have a habit of turning off silhouette, I don't know why it doesn't really matter for this kind of video, but I do it anyway. <laughs> Human... IDF... Here, the helmet... Well now it sits way too far low. See, we don't want that. But at least this, at least we know that editing those that line of numbers is working. Sometimes the uh, swapping out the orientation for matrix 34 and whatnot doesn't actually change anything. So mm, let's go. So we're just doing a very small number since it doesn't seem to need a big change. Again, sometimes, uh, you know, it, it'll take a while to mess around with the numbers. Um, you 
can't just sometimes you can't just do very simple one two or three uh, adjustments uh, sometimes you have to get very specific with the numbering but if you don't really care that it clips a little bit as long as it kind of looks like it's on the head normally then I mean that's kind of what we're going for but if you do want it very specific you want the chin strap perfectly covering the chin or whatever uh, yeah And you'll have to get a lot more specific with the numbering. Go here, delete. Go down, turn equipment. Head. So as you can see, it is lowered. You can see more of the chin strap now. It's not as stabbing upwards, though I think we need to push it forward a little bit. Mm. You know, let's try, let's try, uh, lowering it a bit more. Um, let's do maybe 20. Then push it forward a little bit. We'll do 0. Point Five. Save. Launch the game. Enter cycling bin. Sometimes that mounting resources from the workshop is a good sign because it shows that you changed or edited something so it just needs to load in that new whatever coding. All the way down. Yes, my see sliding it forward was a bit much so maybe we just need to so lowering it was good but we just need to slide it back by like a little bit as you can see you have to be very specific with numbers we'll do two And again, sometimes I, I might just be, I, this might just be me getting lucky with the numbering not having to be too much. Sometimes you'll even see the preset numbers for certain helmets, like it's a whole bunch of different numbers and zeros and stuff. But uh, thankfully I don't think we really need to focus on that. Look at that. Now it fits. As you can see, it covers the ear. The chin strap now shows. And uh, you can kind of tell that it might need to be raised a little bit. But honestly, I think it looks fine. It kind of looks like it's supposed to rest on the bottom of the chin, but uh, obviously that's, uh, you know, if you want to get more specific with it. Uh, the same uh, process applies to adjusting body armor. Um, I've noticed that some body armor, even when you do properly adjust the numbers, the skin itself uh, will still kind of like clip through it. So sometimes uh, it might be the skin that you'll have to change or like the model. So um, I could be wrong, but uh, that's my experience from having to edit the... Uh, uh, the body armor so if you want a video on that or if you want uh, more specific details 
I'm more than happy to do so, but this is just a quick show tutorial. I hope this helped. Um, actually, you know what? I'm also going to show you something else. Uh, no. So sometimes, when you edit the ori when you change orientation to Matrix 34 and you edit this line of code, you'll notice that the helmet doesn't actually change. Sometimes you actually have to scroll down, and sometimes there's a line of code that'll say um, positioning, and it'll have Matrix 34, and it'll have the four lines of code, and that too can sometimes be where it is. Because uh, I remember the first time that I tried it when I was shown how by uh, Weasel. Uh, you know, I was like, I put in Matrix 34, I edited the bottom line of numbers, nothing's happening. And then I scrolled down and I realized there was positioning head or positioning helmet and those same four lines. And I edited that and that's where it was. So sometimes uh, this won't work. Sometimes you have to look for positioning. Uh, so just in case any of you do come across that and you're like, hey, I did your four lines of code, I did Matrix 34, it's not working, so make sure you look for positioning helmet, or positioning head, because that too can sometimes be it. Uh, so again, I hope this helped, and uh, feel free to leave any questions, I will try to answer as best as I can.